Microcirculation. The human physical body is a very complex and mysterious body organization that is made up of five major internal organs and other various organs, as well as a maze of interconnectivity amongst all these organs that bond the flesh and the blood together. The basic building block of this life system, from which the vital life force, the thinking process, and the creative ability come from, is none other than a cell. Do you know how many cells there are in a human body? According to a rough estimation by scientists, there are about 500 to 600 trillion cells in a human body. In the humongous system, made up by the 500 to 600 trillion cells, each and every one of these cells need to replenish fresh oxygen, water and nutrition at every single moment, while there is a perpetual flow of substances, energy and messages amongst all these trillion cells at all times. The passing and relaying of substances, energy and messages between cells in the human body is the most important life activity accomplished by microcirculation. Healthy microcirculation is the sure sign of good health for the human body. The microcirculation spreads all around every organ in the human body, formed by the extensive blood vessel system from every part of the internal structure. The microcirculation comprises blood cells, blood and various nutritional elements. In microcirculation, the smallest micro blood vessel is only 2 microns, while the biggest is 100 microns. In average, a microcirculatory vessel is about 1 over 20 of a strand of human hair. A capillary is the smallest microcirculatory vessel. It is also the most important component in which tissue cells conduct the exchange of substances. The capillaries are found between the micro arteries and micro veins, about 5 to 9 microns in size. Therefore, even a single red blood cell has to change size in order to pass through a capillary of a smaller diameter. According to statistics, there are about 10 billion capillaries in the human body, with a surface area as big as 500 to 700 square meters, or that of a football field. If these capillaries were to be connected, its total length is enough to circumvent the diameter of the Earth one and a half times, that is, about 9 million meters long. The much-needed oxygen, nutritional elements and energy in the human body is transported by microcirculation to each functional tissue, while it also transports the harmful byproducts of metabolism, such as muscle acids, lactic acid and carbon dioxide out of the human body. The microcirculatory system is not part of the metabolic process in the human body, but the seat in the body where metabolism takes place. It is thus the capsule of the internal human body, the most basic guarantee for a human life. Every organ in the human body, including the heart, needs to have normal and healthy microcirculation. If the microcirculation is congested, thus obstructing the normal microcirculatory function or reducing the normal volume of blood flow, then the metabolic needs of the tissue cells in terms of oxygen and nutritional elements would not be met hence leading to the onset of diseases.